What is going on guys, it is L321 here today, and today guys, I'm going to be showing you how to get custom gamer pictures on your Xbox One, so without further ado, let's get straight into this video. So I have made a video on this already, but it wasn't that great compared to this new method which has recently came out. Not actually too sure how long it's been around for, first of all, you will need to download the tool in the description of this video just go ahead and download it and once you've got it guys this is what we're going to do so what we're going to do guys is open up the tool and it's called fiddler 4 doesn't take too long to install nice and easy so once you've got it open guys we're going to put this on full screen so the first thing we're going to do guys is go to the tool section and go to this section right here the fiddler options and we are going to go to https and we're going to make sure this box is ticked right here, very important. And once you've got that ticked, guys, you're going to click Actions. And then you're going to click Trust Root Certificate. Now you're going to get this message, uh, read it if you want, guys. And then press Yes. So now it's going to ask for permission, you can click Yes to that. And you're just going to make sure you confirm it. And as you can see, it has been approved and it's all good to go. So now what we're going to do, guys, is make sure once again this box is ticked. It's very important. So next thing you're going to do, guys, is go to the protocol section. And you're going to want to copy and paste this code. The code will be in the description of this video. Nice and easy. Copy and paste it in there. Click OK. And now what I would do is restart the program. So what we're going to do now, guys, is go to where it says win config. And now, guys, we're going to get a list of programs which are running on your PC. Now, what I did forget to mention is you guys are going to need to install the Xbox Avatar app. So if you guys haven't got that yet, make sure you got that installed. And of course, I'm assuming you guys have the Xbox app as well. I'm pretty sure it's already installed on your Windows 10 PC. And once you do have the Xbox Avatar app, um, you will see it appear in here. So all you need to do is tick that box and also the Xbox um, box as well. So get them ticked. There's nothing else you need to tick from there. And what you're going to do is click save changes. So once you've done that, guys, now what we're going to do is open up the Xbox avatar app. So guys, once this has loaded up, what we're going to do is go to the camera section right here. And once we've gone to that, guys, we're going to take a picture of our avatar. And once we've done that, we're going to make sure we select save as gamer pick. And once you've done that, guys, it should save that photo as your new gamer picture you're going to click close we are going to cross off the xbox avatar app now so you're going to go down this list here guys and you're going to click on profile.xboxlive.com and ensure that you're on the composer section as well and we're going to just go ahead and drag this in so next guys we're going to edit this code right here we're going to change the one to zero and once you've done that guys you're going to click execute wait for that to do that so once you've done that guys we're going to now drag the gamerpix.xboxlive into the same box so once you've opened that up guys you can see loads of code you don't have to worry about that all we're going to do is click the upload file button and you're going to select your gamer picture also guys the file does have to be well the picture does have to be 1080 by 1080 pixels and you can use a png or a jpeg it doesn't matter png is obviously a better quality photo but jpeg is pretty much the same and it's smaller in size so it's up to you what you guys pick so once you have done that guys you will see a pathway right here of where your gaming picture is and you also see some code up here and we just want to go ahead and just delete this line of code so we just delete it like that and now what we're going to do is click the execute button once again and that is pretty much it so all you have to do now really is just go ahead and check to make sure it's worked so we're going to go back onto the xbox app and if I go to my profile, you will now see that I have that picture I just selected. You guys didn't actually see it, but here we go. Here is the picture. I originally had the um, just the picture of the avatar. It is now changed to this, which is pretty darn cool. There is a chance you can get banned for this, guys. Of course, there's always a risk. So keep that in mind when doing this. If you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos just like this, let me know by giving this video a like. That would help me out so much. Also, make sure to subscribe to my channel if you are new to miss out on the best modding, trolling, and gaming content. And I will see you next time. Thank you guys for watching. Just click the annotation on screen now to check out my previous video. And don't be a donkey. Slap that subscribe button silly. And I'll see you in my next video.